again. The morning sees us. My life is off limit. My life is not available. Go back and die with your seed. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to command it to go back. That seed of poverty, tell them to take it back. That seed of sickness, tell them to take it back. That seed of confusion, tell them to take it back. They are not welcome in your life in the name of Jesus. Yo, the money see so my life is off limit in the mighty name of Jesus. Go back with your seed and die with it in the mighty name of Jesus. Aha! Aha! In Jesus' name we say, say, you powers attacking me in my sleep be exposed, disgraced, and destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Every power that is attacking you in your sleep commanded to be exposed, commanded to be disgraced, and destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. My Father and my God, by the authority of your word, I command every power, every demonic power that is attacking me while I'm sleeping. My father, by the authority of your word, I command it to be exposed. I command it to be disgraced and be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Be exposed, be disgraced, and be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Be exposed, be disgraced, and be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Be exposed, be disgraced, and be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, now I want you to understand this. Many a times you see people come to your sleep. People come to your sleep. Sometimes they do certain things to you or around you that you know is not in line with what you want in your life. And you can't help it. They came, you try to figure the face of that person. You can't see the face. But you know something is going on. And sometimes they come with the face you know. But the truth is that it's not the person that came. They knew that you are familiar with this person. So they possess that person's face to use that face to come at you. Now, how you assess is the person they came with their face, check their life if you know them. It's true what you see because the Jesus said, by their fruit, we know them. Satan is a confusionist. Sometimes when he want to confuse people, he will use even an innocent face to come at you. But you have to check what was done and check the person that they used their face to come because the spirit of God will reveal to you whether that person is the person. Because sometimes it could be the person. Mm -hmm. It could be the person for real. So you see why you must have what is called designment of the spirit. Praise the Lord. Satan can never use a familiar face to come at you that will do good thing. If you see a familiar face come at you in your dream and did something good for your favor, it's true. God used that person to do that. But any familiar face that come to you and aim to harm you or to do something detrimental to your will and your, you know, your desire, there's two things there. First of all, by the fruit of that person in the physical, you can assess them. Apart from that, if it's the enemy that did this, all you need to do is to begin to ask for them to be exposed because if they succeed once, they will come again. So, but if God opened the veil, you will not see the real person. If it's not that person, that the real code, the person that is on that code will, will show itself. At first, they will flash the person, but within the dream, you see the thing change to another face. That face that is changed to is the face behind. It's like a masquerade. It's like a mask. They use the mask. I have seen something on the online where some of these our movie stars, they use something like mask and, uh, you know, mimic somebody's face. Even Donald Trump. When you see the person, the person's face look like Donald Trump. Color, everything. All those things Hollywood are showing you have been done in the spirit realm. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. But as I keep saying to you, when you are a prayerful child of God, whichever way they, they come, 
At the end, you'll see me victorious in it. Praise the Lord. Say this after me. Say this after me. Your powers attacking me in my sleep be exposed, be disgraced, and destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Begin to command it to be exposed, begin to command it to be disgraced, and begin to command it to be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. I stand by the authority in the name of Jesus, and I command every power that is attacking me in my sleep with a straight face. I command it to be exposed, I command it to be disgraced, and I command it to be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Be exposed, be disgraced, and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Be exposed, be disgraced, and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, say this after me, ladder of failure. At the age of breakthroughs, your time is up. Be broken into irreparable pieces in the name of Jesus. Every ladder of failure at your age of breakthrough, command that ladder to break beyond the repair. Let that ladder break beyond the repair. Every ladder of failure at the age of breakthrough, every ladder of failure at the age of advancement, break into irreparable pieces in the mighty name of Jesus. Command it to be broken. Command that ladder to break. Command that ladder to shatter. Command that ladder to shatter. Every ladder of failure. At the age of breakthrough, your time is up. Break into irreparable pieces. Break into irreparable pieces. Break into irreparable pieces. In the mighty name of Jesus, every ladder of failure, every ladder of backwardness, at the age of breakthroughs, break into irreparable pieces. Be broken into irreparable pieces. In the mighty name of Jesus, be broken beyond repair. In the mighty name of Jesus. Aha! Be broken. Be broken. In the mighty name of Jesus. Be shattered. In the mighty name of Jesus. Be completely destroyed. In the mighty name of Jesus. I will not fail. I will always succeed. Begin to declare it. I will always succeed. Therefore, you ladder of failure, at my age of breakthrough, break into irreparable pieces. Break beyond measure. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, now say powers assigned to lure me, to lure me into taking dangerous risk. My life is not available. That in the name of Jesus, begin to command any power that is leading you to be taking, making dangerous risk, taking dangerous risk, command that power to be destroyed. Command that power to be destroyed. Any power assigned to lure me into taking dangerous risk. Your time is up. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus. 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 Any power that is assigned to lure me into making taking dangerous risk in life uh, be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we say this prayer point is very important for most young youths these days. I use them as an example. One thing I discovered that that killed many young men I know. All my time in Nassau, 24 years now, is bike. Now, if you watch, you find out that these young men are young men mostly. You're riding bike on the road, straight road, with jungle road in Nassau. It's not enough for you. It's to try to fly with it with one leg. Do you understand this? And this is a delight of most of these young men. In fact, they go by the sports center to learn how to turn the bike into flying carpet. Is There is a power behind the scene that they don't see. That power just wants them to spill their blood. And they always do that. If they don't die, absolutely, there will be broken legs, blood must be gushed out, and there is power behind that particular place of accident to take their own portion. Believe what I just said. Praise the Lord. I use it as an example, but there are other risks that we do 
and venture into because we want to prove that, you know, we got it. You don't have it. Once you start doing something out of the ordinary, you are taking dangerous risk. There are risks that is foolishness and there are risks that are worth taking. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Say this after me. By the authority in the word of God, I command every power assigned to lure me into making, taking dangerous risk. Die in the name of Jesus. No powers assigned to lure me into taking dangerous risk. Die in the mighty name of Jesus. My life is not available in every area of my life. Any power that is assigned to lure me into taking dangerous risk. My life is not available. Die in the mighty name of Jesus. 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 Anything you can remember that you find yourself trying to do and when you look at it, you know that this is a risk and that risk is not beneficial just for nothing. That is power. There is power behind that scene. There is power behind that scene. There is power that is pushing that button. Commanded to die in the name of Jesus. Command that power to be decimated in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, say, miracle that surpasses all understanding. My life is available. Manifest, manifest upon my life in the name of Jesus. Miracles that surpasses all understanding. You know, miracle that people will see, they cannot explain it. Let it come upon your life. You better pray this prayer. You better pray this prayer. This is all you have as a child of God. In this kind of prayer, you change things. Miracle that surpasses all understanding. Miracles that cannot be analyzed. Miracle that men will see and know that this one is God. Manifest, manifest in my life, manifest in my life, manifest in my life, manifest in my life. Miracle that surpasses uh, the understanding of men, miracle that will defy logic. Uh, manifest in my life in the name of Jesus. Manifest, 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 manifest in my life in the name of Jesus. Manifest in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, power, sir, pulling me backwards, sir, in life, uh, release me now by fire, release me now by fire and die, release me now by fire, in the mighty name of Jesus, any power that is pulling you backwards in life, uh, command that power to release you now, and die by fire, command that power to release you right now, release you right now, that power that is pulling you backwards, that power that is pulling you backwards in life, uh, it is forward ever for you, backward never, therefore any power that is pulling you backwards, command that power power to release you. Let your hands off you. The mighty name of Jesus. The mighty name of Jesus. Your powers that is pulling me backwards. Uh, the blood of Jesus is against you. Release me by fire. The mighty name of Jesus. Release my destiny by fire. Shake them off. Shake them off. Shake them off. Uh, release me by fire. Mighty name of Jesus, release me by fire and die in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, say I recover all my wasted years 100 fold in the mighty name of Jesus. Take it back, take it back. Every wasted years, all your wasted years, years you wasted, begin to recover them 100 fold. God gave you time frame in this life. You can take back any year among those days he gave to you that you wasted. Recover it back. Remember, by your word you can be justified. He said, decree a thing and you shall decree a thing and it shall be established. Recover your wasted years. Hundredfold, hundredfold, hundredfold. Take them back, take them back, take them back, take them back. In the mighty name of Jesus, take them back. I recover all my wasted years. Hundredfold. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, 
in Jesus' name we say, you may say, Pastor, is it possible? Much, much than possible. Praise the Lord. When you were assigned, when you were, when you were created and sent on this part of the universe, there are times God stayed for you to accomplish certain tasks. There are times when you begin to enjoy the fruit of your labor. But because of the world wickedness, some of us end up being diverted in our days of ignorance. Listen to me, look at me. These things are reality. In our days of ignorance, we end up being diverted. We start doing things that derailed our original timing. So now, when you have come to the account, uh, the knowledge of this fact, you can call those wasted years back. How would they show up? You'll be surprised that those things that you're supposed to achieve, even though you didn't achieve when you're supposed to achieve it, for the sake that you have called them back, God will create another opportunity for you to fulfill them. And it might be, it might, this is the reason why you hear this, the, the word that says, your latter days will be better than your former. Praise the Lord. Believe in that. Believe in that and stay with God. You'll be surprised. It might look like things see, adding up now. Stay with God and you'll be surprised what will happen. I'm, I'm saying what I'm, I'm saying what I'm saying because I felt it in my spirit to tell him. His determination. His determination. His resolve. It might sound stupid. But we'll still testify about it here. Amen. There's nothing impossible. The Bible says with God all things are possible. I mean what I'm saying. I have seen signs of this in my own life. You see those days you are gambling and doing all those foolishness. When God, when you call, when you call, the Bible says that you shall call on me and I will answer you. My God. Sometimes when we say this thing, People who don't understand spiritual things will think it's a talk. It's not a talk. You can call your wasted years all those times you wasted. Because remember, there is still a time that you have to depart. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Say this after me. I recover all my wasted years a hundredfold in the mighty name of Jesus. I will not live no stall of God. Every wasted years in my life, I take you back on the fold. I recover you on the fold. I recover you on the fold. I recover you on the fold. In the name of Jesus, I take you back on the fold. All those years that I wasted doing things I wasn't supposed to do. Following things I wasn't supposed to follow. My Father, by your mercy, release them back to me, O Lord. Release them back to me. I demand for them. I demand for them. You said that the desire of the righteous will never be cut off. My Father, I call back all my wasted years. I take them back on the fold. In the mighty name of Jesus, in every area. In every area. Jesus name we say. Say this after me. From now on, people of all nations of this earth shall compete to favor me by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus. Begin to declare that people of all nations of this earth shall compete. They shall compete to favor me by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus. From now on, people of all nations in this earth shall compete. 
light uh, to favor me in the mighty name of Jesus. Everywhere I go, I shall be favored uh, by peoples of all nations of this earth. People from all nations of this earth shall favor me by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. The earth is the Lord's uh, and the fullness thereof. Uh, the world and everything in it. Uh, the heart of the king uh, is in the hand of the Lord like the rivers of water. And he will always turn it wherever he will. Uh, I decree, declare it uh, that from now on, uh, people of all nations uh, shall favor me. They shall compete to favor me. Everywhere I go, they shall favor me. Everywhere I step in, they shall favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus, wherever the fruit of my feet uh, shall tread, uh, they shall favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus, they shall favor me. Ha! They shall favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus. Everywhere I go, people of all nations, they can come from China, they can come from Afghanistan, they can come from Mexico, they can come from America, they can come from Africa, they can come from the ends of the earth. As soon as they see me, they shall roll to favor me. In fact, they will be competing. The one from China will say, no, let me do it for him. The one from Afghanistan will say, no, I can do it. The one from Mexico will say, no, he's close to my terrain. I will do it. And that's what will happen in the name of Jesus. People of all nations shall compete to favor me. They shall compete to favor me. They shall compete to favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus. Aha! Aha! So shall it be in your life in the name of Jesus. You will testify to the glory of God. So shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, Oh Lord my Father, do something new that will trigger celebrations in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to ask God to do something new that will trigger celebrations in your life. In the name of Jesus, my Father, do something new that will trigger celebrations in this house. In the mighty name of Jesus, do something new that will trigger celebrations in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let God do something new. Let God do something new. The Bible says that his blessings are new every morning. There is no ending to the blessings from the throne of grace. My father, do something new in my life. Thou will spark celebration in the mighty name of Jesus. Something new that will spark celebration. Something new that will trigger celebration in my life. Father, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it, do it in the name of Jesus. Do something new in this house that will spark celebration, that will trigger celebration, that will call for celebration in the mighty name of Jesus. Aha! In Jesus' name we say, by the power in the blood of Jesus, I will sing my song and dance my dance in this season. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to declare that I will sing my song and dance my dance in this season. In this season, I will sing my song and I will dance my dance in this season. By the power in the blood of Jesus, I, Apostle Joshua, will sing my song. I will dance my dance in this season. In the mighty name of Jesus, I will sing my song and dance my dance in the mighty name of Jesus. Declare, child of God, you will sing your song and dance your dance in this season. That is the word. We always sing our song and dance our dance in this season by the authority in the mighty name of Jesus. We will sing our song and dance our dance in this ember month in the name of Jesus. September, October, November, December. We will sing our song and dance our dance in the name of Jesus. What the enemy meant in this ember month will be the opposite on our side. It shall be celebration for us in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, this is why this prayer is important. Every ember month is designed, I keep saying it for years in this house, is always the time they regroup 
to fill in their blood bank. That's why a lot of uncalled situations do happen in this kind of month. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. For years I've been saying it. You see God bring us in any, in this Imba month and still we prevail. We should never stop. Season of celebration in the name of Jesus. I say it shall be season of favor in the mighty name of Jesus. We will sing our song and dance our dance in this Imba month. Declare it. I call your name. Shall I sing my song and I will dance my dance as it has been laid and I will dance my dance. No power from the pit of hell can deny it to me, can deny me in the mighty name of Jesus. I will sing my song in this ember month and I will dance my dance to the glory of God in the mighty name of Jesus. We will all sing our song and dance our dance in the mighty name of Jesus. We will all sing our song and dance our dance in this ember month in the name of Jesus. name we say, by your mercy, O oh Lord, make this season uh, to be my best season. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to call him. By your mercy, my father, let this season be my best season. In the mighty name of Jesus, make this season my best season. Make this season my best season. In the mighty name of Jesus, by your mercy, it is by your mercy, O oh God. Make this season uh, my best season. In the mighty name of Jesus, turn this season to be my best season. In the mighty name of Jesus, when uh, Every, when people are crying, Father, make it my best season uh, that I will sing my song uh, and dance my dance uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, make it my best season uh, this ember month, uh, September, October, November, December. Make this month, uh, this season my best season in the mighty name of Jesus. Aha! My best season. My best season in the mighty name of Jesus, ancient of days, make this season our best season in the name of Jesus. By your mercy, in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, I break every stagnant curses you should against my life. Every stagnant curses you should against my life. The curses that are made to keep me stagnant, I break it. I break it in the name of Jesus. Begin to break it. Every stagnant curses you should against your life. Shut it. Break it. Break it. Break it. Break it. I break every stagnant curses you should against my life. I break them. They will not operate. They will not succeed. I shall not be stagnant. I will move forward by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. My father, the same way you made the children of Israel to move from one part of Jordan to the promised land. So shall it be for me. I cannot remain stagnant in this life. I will move forward in the mighty name of Jesus. Every stagnant cause is issued against my life. Be broken. The mighty name of Jesus. Be broken, be broken, be broken. Be broken in the mighty name of Jesus. Be shattered in the mighty name of Jesus. Be completely destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Stagnancy is not my portion. I refuse to be stagnant in life. I cannot be stagnant in the mighty name of Jesus. Better declare it. I cannot be stagnant. I will move with speed of light to the dimension God has destined. Any power that aim to keep me stagnant will face the judgment of God in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, say, oh God, arise and make every shame and disgrace expire in my life. Every shame and disgrace, let them expire, expire, expire. Every shame and disgrace, they are not my portion. Let them expire in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, arise in your anger and turn every shame and disgrace to expire in my life. Make them to expire in my life. Make them to expire in my life in the mighty name of Jesus.
Jesus. Let them inspire. Let them inspire. Let them inspire. Oh God, arise. And let shame and disgrace expire in my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, Oh God, arise in your power and cause problems to expire in my life in the name of Jesus. Let problems expire. I don't care. Whatever problem, let them expire. Let them expire. Their time is up. I shall not face problems. Let every problem hatched by Satan and his agents against my life expire today in the mighty name of Jesus. Let them expire. Let them inspire in the mighty name of Jesus. Every problem structured against my life. Expire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, Oh God, arise and turn my captors to my captives. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and turn my captors to my captives. In the mighty name of Jesus. You better pray that prayer. Let God arise and turn those powers that thought they have captured you. Your own captive, you hold them captive. Table must turn. I said, Table must turn. Table must turn. Let my captors become my captives. Mighty name of Jesus. As they come to arrest you in the dream, you shall arrest them in the mighty name of Jesus. As they come to arrest you, you will in turn arrest them. <laughs> I wish somebody will know what is going on. As they come to arrest you, they shall be arrested by the same you. In the mighty name of Jesus. This is the kind of prayer that set a head with passion. But God has given you the authority to make this declaration and they shall be established. Turn my captors to my captives. Turn my captors to my captives. Turn my captors to my captives. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, My God arise in your power and change my life situations for good. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father arise in your power and change my life situations for good. In the mighty name of Jesus, whatever situations in my life, oh Lord, arise and change them. Turn them around for my own favor. In my favor, in the name of Jesus, let my life, let my life situations be turned to favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus, every situation in my life, my Father, turn them in my favor. In the mighty name of Jesus, for whatever the enemy meant for evil, you, O oh God, have what it takes to turn it in my favor. In the mighty name of Jesus, those things that seems like they have come to take me over, Father, let them begin to work for me. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we say, in Jesus' name we say, Oh Lord my God, by your mercy, make me a sign and a wonder to many. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father, make me a sign and a wonder to many. In the mighty name of Jesus, make me a sign and a wonder. You see me? Make me a sign and a wonder. As I show up, it shall be signs and wonders. It shall be signs and wonders. In the mighty name of Jesus, for it is written, it is written in your word, I am my children whom you have given to me. We are signs and wonders. Father Lord, make me a sign and a wonder to many. In the name of Jesus, as I show up, they shall fear your name by looking at me in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. How? In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name we say, now open your mouth and give God praise. Give God praise. Give God praise. Give God praise.